What's up guys, this is Sean from Digibytes.me and today I got a tips video for you guys and in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to beat chapter 1 of The Bridge. Now a lot of you guys probably don't even know what The Bridge is but it's a new indie game that was just released on Steam that is, it's, it's really fantastic and I encourage anyone out there with a computer to go uh, check it out. It's only $12 right now might be going up till to 15 when you see this video but definitely check it out it's a really good game so I'm gonna show you guys how to beat the f whole first chapter of this game the first uh, chapter it, it starts off with the loft now this game is kinda interesting uh, it's a lot different than any game I've ever played what you do is your goal is to reach the door at the end of each level in various different ways by walking your guy and then shifting the world and so I'm gonna kind of assume that you're looking at this video that you might have an idea you have played this game so I'm just gonna show you guys how to beat this these stages but consecutively so with this one you just follow that ramp twist the world to the press the right on the arrow key and then you'll immediately fall down into that spot and you'll be right there at the door simple next the library now, with that added feature, they add a key to this, and the goal is you have to reach the key first to open the door. And so, and then there's also this wall in the way, and so, how do you get the wall out of the way? Well, you obviously just shift the world over by holding the right on the keypad, or the num arrow pad, just kidding. Move that all the way over, and then you're going to want to drop down here, shift the, pick up the key first, and then shift the world back to the other side, so that the... Oh wait, am I wrong? Can I walk up this? Uh, <laughs> alright. Maybe I was a little off. Uh, don't slide, don't slide. Okay, head back over here. Oh yeah, and then just keep holding right. I'm, I'm dumb, I was thinking too much into it. Just keep holding the right on the arrow key. And it'll slide back down and you beat number two. Next, the third part of chapter one is the menace. Now, this adds another new feature of a little evil ball that if it touches you, it will essentially kill you, but you don't really die in this game. So, what you want to do is get the ball into the other open area where I'm walking to by holding right on the arrow key. First, it's going to head over to the door area. Just keep holding right on the arrow key, and then you're going to want to drop down into here. Maybe I was kidding. <laughs> oh yeah, I was right. Okay. And now he's going to fall into that empty spot. Keep holding right, and then you're going to just drop down here. And you got the door. Bam. Chapter 1, Part 4, The Courtyard. Now, with The Courtyard, it's just going to have... It's going to add... He doesn't add anything new. It just adds that the key and the menace and the door, they're all in the same one. So what you want to do is just climb over, twist the world to the right by holding on the right arrow key. Get up this a little bit. And you want to drop down here. And what you want to do is kind of get the ball swaying back and forth so you can go under it. Make sure to drop right at the perfect moment when he's swaying back. Ooh, I might messed up, but you... If I hit him, I'll show you, it'll show you, I can show you something. Okay, I hit him. So now you, when you get hit, you use the space bar to, it basically just reverses the game to where you previously at. I might have fucked up again. <laughs> okay, don't do this what I'm doing. Okay, head back up here. Get him swaying so you dodge him. Make sure you time this at the perfect moment. Now I want to hurry my ass over. Okay, I'm back in the tree. Come on, don't hit him. Okay, I guess you can just hold it to the left more. Just lean the whole world to the left slightly. And now you're just going to hold left on the arrow key to get this key. And now the next thing we have to do is get up to the key. And what we have to do is get by the menace again. Let's see, get him swaying back and forth. Just keep swaying the earth by. And then fall into this little pocket down here. Keep holding right on the arrow key. And then you will drop down into the door area. And you've just completed... Ooh, I almost fell. The next chapter. 
or not the next in the next part so part five is the spiral and if there is one that's going to complicate you in this game it is definitely the spiral my first time playing i was definitely confused on this one and it took me a little bit to understand it but now it's a piece of cake since i know what i'm doing so basically it's a kind of a perspective kind of thing um what we're gonna do is we're gonna you're not focusing on your guy to say but you're focusing on the two keys in the left and right spiral and on the first one we're gonna pay attention to the right spiral and how we're gonna do this is we're gonna bring try to get the keys down to us so what we're gonna do is hold right on the arrow key and just keep holding right on it just keep holding on to it and the key's just gonna keep going round and around and around and then it changes it's gonna change perspectives and fall straight down to us on this little that little wall and here it comes all right so we got that key next part what we have to do is the same thing but go left to, to get the other key so just hold left on your arrow key now you don't have to pick the keys up yet um, you could if you want to but you don't have to just keep holding left keep holding left okay now what you're gonna see is like oh it's just gonna fall off the world well it, it will if you don't do this right what you're gonna want to do is just slowly slowly move the key down and then push hold right on it and it's just gonna sway into this out oh, I messed up well you might have seen what I was doing but it's gonna sway and miss the wall again okay let me go back a little bit more all right just nudge it a little bit but it's gonna hit the other spiral Let's see if I got it this time. Up oh, a little bit more. And oh, wow, why am I having such trouble with this? Come on. Come key. Alright. It's being really difficult. Wow. <laughs> I apologize, guys. Technical difficulty right here. Come on, key. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Alright, there we go. God, that was a lot more pain. And so now it's in this spiral, so we'll do what we did with the last key and just hold right on it. And it'll come down to us, and then we can unlock the door. With a little bit of patience. Little, little, little. Lots of spinning we got here. Come on, key. And, alright, so let's get that one and then get through the door and head on to the next part. Come on, oh man, really? I can't walk this? There we go. Alright, next part. Level 6 is the Nook. Now, this one's kind of tough as well. Because avoiding the menace is kind of a pain in the ass. So what you want to do is, you're going to hold left on the arrow key and kind of climb, hug this wall over here. What you're, we're going to want to do is get the menace into the open spot where we just were slightly move him down here just keep holding left get him in that area and you're gonna want to drop down here and with this part is you're gonna hold right and get him to go above you back down you should make it yep there we go all right so now we have all we have to do is fall down to the door easy peasy and there we go that is chapter one of the indie new indie game the bridge Hope you guys enjoyed watching. I definitely recommend this game. It's a lot of fun, really challenging, but I'm for sure you're going to love it. And thank you guys for watching. Uh, make sure to subscribe to this channel and also check out the website digibytes.me. And also make sure if you're interested in videos like this to go check out my videos and maybe subscribe to me if you like this kind of stuff. Uh, thanks again for watching, guys. Peace out.